Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to Airport CEO. Today we're back on Yorkshire International, just having a look at where our new food place hall, whatchamacallits, are. Uh, the restaurants, yes, the restaurants are, uh, are doing quite well. This one here, the Valentino's, is uh, sold 861 of 220. It's made £31,000, so that's quite good, you know, I can't really argue with that. And uh, Petit Bisou, our, uh, our latest restaurant, has done 209 of 220. Now, it's nearly closing time. Uh, is it midnight that they close? Yeah, it's midnight. So I reckon they can get 11 sales, 10 sales, in, uh, in the space of two and a half hours. But, of course, don't forget that this only opened halfway through the day, so that's at a full day pretty much now to make money this has only opened halfway through the day so uh, you know that we can't really hold it against Petit Bisou because uh, they've not had a full day of operation now the toilets are almost done over here if we just speed things up there's a bit of a wall to go in here uh, the walls between the urinals the ladies is practically done now uh, oh what on earth's happening here oh dear right okay why, why is everyone dropping oh dear Right, we need some bins. We need some bins. This is not good. Right, okay. Let's let's put some round the edge. There we go. And it looks like we need one at the end of that that travelator. There we go. Just just one there. Pop one there as well. We'll just put bins at the end on on both sides, I think, because if you're coming down the other side. Oh, hang on, not there. I hate it how it does that. It lags and then uh, wherever your mouse cursor ends up, it, it, it kicks off at you and uh, puts it in the wrong place. There we go. Let's have some proper bins, please. Oh, janitor man's here. Oh, he really needs a wee. Well, the good news is, Burak Kaya, that there's a bathroom just there. And uh, and when they've finished building it, then uh, then you can, you can wee away till your heart's content. I can't believe they've done that. Look, they've absolutely trashed our airport. Look at that! This is ridiculous! There's just rubbish everywhere, and it's where people walk. I do like that, how the rubbish appears where, you know, where people walk. It's good. Right, have we got... Have we got some bins in now? Can we... Where are all our workmen? Where are they all? Right, we've got a sink and a hand dryer, so we can open that. We'll just open it while they're still working on it, it'll be fine. Uh, we've not got a... Uh, we'll have one sink and one hand dryer minimum and then we'll open that to the public. Right, we've got a sink. They can just they can just wipe their hands on the jeans, can't they? Oh, there's a hand dryer there now. There we go, everybody in. Toilets are open, everybody. Yes, thank you. We could also do with some more chairs, couldn't we? Uh, what about... Right, okay, some more chairs. This area is actually coming to life, isn't it? I'm, I'm really pleased with this. Right, hang on, what are we doing now? So, we'll put them opposite this. Oh no, we won't put them here. Right, there we go. We'll have another two there. Have a gap for like a plant of some sort. Oh, what's what's happening? There we go. A little bit of lag now, isn't there, on uh, on airport CEO? And we'll have another one there. Lovely. Right, okay. Assuming you're the same length, which you're not. That'd be right. Right, we're going to put you down the middle, ish. Yep, we're going to put you there. And leave that one vacant in the middle so people can walk between. Yes. Right, can we can we stick you at the end? We could do. Hmm. I'll just leave it there, because people are walking across, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Build the chairs, please. Right, let's have some plants, because uh, plants always live in the place, aren't they? There we go. We'll have you there. You there. And we'll, we'll have this, uh, that big plant that I like. Where is it? Uh, indoor large plant. There we go. That big potted fern. I just think it brings the place together, doesn't it, really? And we'll have some bins again, because uh, right, we'll have bins there and there bins at the end. There's a lot of bins in this airport, which is quite ironic, given the fact that most airports don't have bins in. Well, they certainly don't have the metal ones, do they? They have the, the plastic bag ones. 
Maybe we need more janitors. Uh, service vehicles. Oh, we have a shortage of pushback trucks. That's a worry. That'd be right. Uh, yeah, we, we need a, a 692 janitorial jobs are available. Oh dear. Right, okay, so we need ramp agents, service technicians. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Where are we? I've forgotten how to do it. I've been playing Planet Coaster quite a bit. And, uh, of course, the menu's different, isn't it? Right, janitor. However good or terrible you are, we'll hire you all. Service technician. Yeah, we'll have the lot of you. And most of you are pretty good, actually. And uh, who else have we got? Ramp agents. Again, most of you are pretty good, so... Uh, so that is good news. We'll uh, we'll train the terrible ones. Train the terrible ones. There we go. Oh no, hang on. We're, we're still hiring. We're still hiring. How do we? How do we? There we go. Right. Everybody, train. Oh, you are awful at your job, aren't you? The CFO. Excellent. The CFO is terrible at their job. That is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Right. We'll train you. Yeah. Come on. Dun, 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 dun. I am so good at this game. Yep, that's that's what we're going with. For those of you that rolled your eyes, and those of you that laughed, I have to tell you. This is a successful airport, and you can't deny the facts. We've got over 7 million, so we've done something right, haven't we? Alright, it might not be the most efficient airport of all time, but... Uh, right, hang on. Let's also have a look downstairs, because we are having a bit of a... Someone was saying, oh, you need to open them. But I think I have opened. Oh, no, I haven't. Right, there we go. Open and open. I thought I'd open them all, you know. Right, we'll get some staff on there. Let's get it open to the public. Come on, security officers. Get cashier number two open. Cashier number two, please. Yeah, there's, there's quite a lot of a queue here, isn't there? Although, to be fair, that one's open and nobody's using that. Have they only just opened? There doesn't seem to be any sort of logic to the ones that they'll use. Yeah, there we go. Right, well they're both open, so let's get some let's get some traffic down here, please. I do like the queue. I think we did an awesome job with the queuing system. I mean, they're not going to think so, are they? Because they have to... Oh, hang on, hang on. Bird strike emergency requires fire truck assistance. Right, can we squeeze you in? Where, where are you? Where's the emergency? There it is. What is it? Can we, can we pop it in? It's an international flight. Pop it there. Why can't we pop it there? Why can't we allocate it to that stand? Where can we allocate it to? Oh, because that's large flights only. Flipping heck. That's... Is that international? How do you tell the difference between international stands and, and non-international stands? Why can't it... It could go there. Oh, it's occupied by the flight. Right, okay. Uh, large aircraft stand. Settings. You will now accept medium flights. Come on. What's that? Yeah, there we go. Right, get rid of the settings tab. You can go in there now. We've got no stands for it. It says it needs it needs to be there within 30 minutes. What about the EasyJet stand? Right, you, you can go on there. It's an emergency. I know you're an international flight, but you'll just have to land on that stand. That's not an international stand. Oh, it must be. Hang on. Oh, no. No, there we go. Right, yeah. Experiencing a bird strike on the way down. That's unfortunate. Normally, it's on the way up that uh, the bird strikes happen. Right, well there we go, the emergency has been handled. Let's have a look. Are we on fire? Can't see the runway. Is that the one? It was a two, wasn't it? That's taking it off. Oh, fire engines are here. Can hear them. Oh, there they are, look. Here it is, the two that's on fire. Flipping heck, it really is on fire. My goodness me. That's not good. Yeah, you, you just stop there. The fire brigade are on their way. They're, they're just stuck behind a baggage truck at the moment. Hey, come on, plane's on fire. Get out of his way. Why don't they overtake? Oh, I don't know. 
Maybe I can do with the emergency services not being quite so far away from the runway. <laughs> oh, this is a disaster! Come on, baggage truck, get out of the way! He's absolutely not bothered, is he? He's just, he's a very, uh, he's a very chilled out baggage truck. Ah, I, I don't mind that the plane's on fire. What on earth's he doing? A little pirouette. Right, get your foot down. Run those people over. Yep, oh, you did actually. Oh, he's going back to try again. Where are you going? Oh, he's, he's crashed into the easy jet. Oh, this is just an absolute disaster. Uh, right, okay, so the, the, the aircraft is... The aircraft's burnt. Right, okay. Uh, mm. Yeah, uh, we, we got 0%. Yeah, we're, we're going to get fined for that, aren't we? Although, to say it's turtled, it seems to be doing a, a fairly good job of moving under its own power, albeit smacking its wing into the hangar. Right, well, what can we learn from that lesson? We need the emergency services to be closer to the runway. Where are the emergency services? Uh, I always forget about our general aviation. They are as far away from everything as it's possible to be. Okay. Hmm. Right. Let's build more of them. Because, yeah, on reflection, perhaps it's not a good idea having them where we've got them. Uh, where are they now? They're somewhere, aren't they? Uh, oh, they're, they're down uh, security, aren't they? There we go. Right, emergency response station. We probably won't need a police station, will we? But we'll have one of you there. And we'll have another one of you. Much closer. What about there? By the by the washing place. Will that do? Yes, of course it will. Of course it will. That'll be fine. We can also put a um, a road round the back in. Hang on, aircraft infrastructure, not aircraft infrastructure, vehicle infrastructure, service road. We'll keep with the uh, the in-keeping theme. Splendid. Um, do you know what, we'll, we'll build you down to there. And across like that, there we go. Now there should be no problems. Look at that, that that's going to be brilliant. Yes, it's going to be an absolute triumph. Now we need more emergency services vehicles, so we need another four, should we say two in each? I reckon that should be fine. Vehicles, add vehicles, uh, right, where are we? Four, yeah, and four fire engines, there we go. Right, they're on the way everybody. What on earth's happening here? Oh, they're building the new road. Splendid. Look at them all, little army of people. How's our bathroom looking, chaps, before we worry about the emergency services vehicles? How are the bathrooms? Oh, they're fully open. Fully operational. This terminal's actually looking pretty good, isn't it? I mean, the problem is on this, it's so easy to... You know, like, this terminal was quite cosy, and I think it looked really good. Like, it looks... Decent? Why is this one? Because it's so big. It's quite difficult to fill it with things, isn't it? Because, truth be known, we don't need uh, all of this seating. We don't need all of this space for these stands here. I mean, this bit looks pretty good down here. I think we could... Could we do something maybe with, like, the, the stands while they're building all of that? Because the carpets, you can change that quite easily. What about, like, a nice sky blue? Over the over the stands, like that. You like that? I quite like that. Just uh, just to make it look a bit better, because at the moment we're just still using the standard ground colour, aren't we? Just, you know, just to just to like brighten the place up a little bit. Like that. There we go. We just just a, a bit of that. So you can see where the stands are, and then we'll we'll also put down here. That can be a bit of that. 
and a, a bit of that. And we'll do it under the windows as well. There we go. Oh my goodness me, look at that. We need some bins. We need some bins, people. I tell you. Right, put a bin there. And there's not really a lot of other places for a bin. Look at that. They're, they're absolute pigs throwing rubbish everywhere. There we go. Bin at the end of each one. Flipping Nora. A lot of them are an absolute disgrace. There we go. Fill them, fill them with bins. There, there's bins everywhere now, so there's no excuse. I reckon that we need a lot more janitors. I've not really been hiring janitors, to be perfectly honest with you. I don't know if you've noticed. But we've not had a problem up until now. Uh, janitor, there we go. Let's hire the lot of you. We, just need, we need all of you. They're wrecking my airport. And we'll, we'll have this nice wood here. It's a bit restaurant -y, isn't it? But, uh, or do we? Should we, should we have... Oh, what about tiles? Maybe not marble. Not concrete, like concrete. Concrete tile, that'll do. Okay, bit of that. I don't think we want carpet in the bathroom, do we? That might not be such a good idea. You don't want a squelchy carpet, do you, while you're trying to, you know, do your ablutions. It's not good. What on earth? Why does it look so shabby already? We've only just put that floor in and it's knackered. Right. That's, uh, okay. So my sense of style perhaps isn't the best. There we go. It's looking brilliant. It's looking better than it did anyway, I'll tell you that. There we go. Pop you in there. Bit of that. Don't you think that looks much better? It looks like we've actually given it some thought now. You can clearly see where the gates are. We could also do with those flight information stands everywhere, couldn't we? Because that speeds people up. And then we've got room for some shops here. More shops, flipping heck. More shops. We don't need more shops. Nobody's buying from our current shops. I'm still not quite sussed out why that might be. Partly because one of them's not open. Because we lost the will to live at the end of one of the episodes. That has actually sold a few. 52 things. That's sold 61. Okay, so you're obviously terrible. It's the four star. It's the, the four star things because they have higher expectations. Yeah, they have a much higher expectation. We could do with downloading like... Um, it's a shame you can't have more than one of the same shop. You know, it seems to only let you have one. Like, we can't have another pick and fly. I need to download some, like, if, I wonder if on the workshop there's, like, actual WH Smiths or there's, you know, it'd be quite nice, wouldn't it? Boots and things like that to put in your airport. I'd like that. There you go. That looks awful, doesn't it, from where I am now? Looks absolutely terrible. But it's fine. It's it's good. It's it's not good, Joe. It's awful. But it's it's fine. It'll do. It looks better than the standard grey, doesn't it? Flipping it, what is with this lag today? You can tell the airport's getting a bit busier, can't you? How did you do today? Oh, you've met your target, that's good. You've well exceeded your target. Valentinos, they love it, don't they? Now! Yeah, hang on, we've got our new emergency services vehicles. We need to actually allocate them, don't we, to the... That's flight planner. You muppet. Right. Vehicles, where are we? There, yeah, we'll assign you to, to, to there. Why has he come out over here? Why would you do that to me? For goodness sake. Right, okay. Oh, you just want to bray your head against the wall sometimes, don't you? Why would you come this way? Oh, right. Well, we need a, we, we need a, a vehicle checkpoint then, don't we? Right, okay. Right, well, we'll put him there. I didn't mean to put him there, but we'll put him there. We'll put him there. Keep smiling, Joe. Come on. You can get through this. Delete you two, and we'll delete you as well. You can go like that. You can go like that. There we go. And then where the road is, I don't know if we'll have to wait for it to be deleted first, actually. 
Uh, right, there we go. Yeah, road. Structure location not possible. Okay. And that is, of course, because the, uh, the, the thing's in the way. Can we get can we get some tarmac down, please, while uh, while we're waiting? No. Okay. It's very dark, isn't it? You, you do struggle to see when it's dark. I could put some lamp posts, couldn't I? These lamp posts are nice. Could put some more down, but uh, but we haven't got time. We've got to get this done. Come on, guys. Let's get this built. There we go. Oh, okay, well, well, beneath the wall, that's a good start. At least then we'll be able to plumb the road in. Uh, right, okay, right, we'll, we'll use that. Right, you're not possible still. Well, well, we'll just build the rest of it then while we're waiting for... Uh, for O'Reilly builders to, uh, to to pop all that in. There we go, lovely. Right, can we, can we actually do it now? Lovely, right. There we go. We've got a vehicle checkpoint, everybody. So perhaps, what's what's this? Well, they will be. They will be. Just just old horses. If you can if you can see, look, the blueprints are here for the building of the new road. Oh dear me! There's not enough coffee in the world to. Uh, to get me through this, tell you. Right, well, while that's building, I can't believe that ambulance has come out there. What a ninny. What an absolute idiot. Why can't you just drive road round? Surely there'll be a road linking that to, to there, to down there on, on the outside world. Oh, it's still stropping. I like how they always build in, in random chunks as well, don't they? They never just build one side. Look at that. They can actually zigzag their way down, so they, he would be able to get down this. They'd just zigzag. So if we, if we can just build this bit, this bit, and this bit, that'd be lovely. I don't know. I, I always think this looked quite nice. We did a good job with this, didn't we? I mean, the blue and orange clashes horrendously, doesn't it? But then it's under, like, the EasyJet planes in the sky. What are you? Oh, Trinity Aviation. I thought I didn't recognise the livery. It's a fictional one. I mean, this has got stupidly busy, hasn't it, since... Uh, oh, my God, what's happening here? So this is good though, isn't it? This is nice and efficient. The baggage is uh, is just fantastic. There's lots being destroyed. The, the hell, there is a lot being destroyed. He's just kicking off every bag that bag that comes to him. He's just not bothered. This chap is he? Look, just everything. Is there something wrong with him? Oh, he's tired. Yeah, that, that could be why. Well, why don't you go for a break, sir? Let's just hire a, a tub more of the, uh, the of the security officers. There we go. We'll just hire loads more. He's just been in everyone's bags. This is a disaster. Not service technician, security officer. There we go. We've got a staff room near here for these guys. I don't know if we have. Sir, stop destroying people's baggage, please. <laughs> You're giving our airport a bad reputation. They're all going to arrive on their holidays and there'll be no knickers. All the bikinis will have been lost. They'll have been blown up at Yorkshire International. <laughs> no, not good, not good, not good. We're going to have a terrible reputation, aren't we, as an airport? I think that, to be fair, we'd, we've got quite an efficient operation in the new terminal. I mean, we need to look at the old terminal, really, don't we? Because I haven't got a clue what's going on in there. It seems to keep working though, doesn't it? We don't get a lot of uh, messages about delayed flights. There we go. Train them all. They're all brilliant. All of my staff are not awful. There we go. 
Why can't you send them for their break? Where is the nearest staff room for these guys? Oh, it's there. Why don't we make them one here? That would be nice, wouldn't it? Right, so we'll we'll have a we'll have that there, so that can be a bathroom. And that can be the staff room. Lovely. Look at that. I am a, a caring employer actually, aren't I? Of course I am! We don't actually need any floor in here, do we? Because it's it don't matter. It can be the nice staff room. And then a nice bit of uh, marble. We'll have a, a marble bathroom, there you go. Practically executive these guys. Oh yeah, we need to we need to tell them it's a bathroom. So that's gonna be a bathroom. It'll be unisex as well. So put that in your pipe and smoke it. And then we need some chairs. Uh, hang on. We're having a bit of a disaster. It's R, isn't it? For some reason, I've just completely forgot how to rotate furniture. There we go. And what about some vending machines? Can we, can we have vending machines? Yes? No? They're there somewhere, aren't they? Are they there? Nope, terminal... Where are they? There they are. Oh, that's a bit big, isn't it? Oh, okay, never mind. But we won't have vending machines, it's fine. It's fine. Right, we'll have a toilet there. Not a urinal. A sink. And a, and a hand dryer. There we go. I, I don't think I've labelled that as a staff room, have I? Staff zone, staff room. Lovely. Right, that is going to be... Uh, who can go in there? Nobody apart from security officers. And ramp agents, because they're there, aren't they? There we go, open the pair of them. <laughs> you just go to the bathroom and it's just an empty room. What's happening here? Oh, these are people leaving. Why do they always stand there? Why don't they just go straight away? They're causing a, a queue. Oh my god, that's busy, isn't it? A lot of people using the bathroom. Our costs are flying in. Charging a fiver for the bathroom was one of the best things we ever did. He's looking for the loo. It's like, oh, she, sorry. It's like, I just really need a wee. <laughs> Everyone is, isn't it, aren't they? Yeah. Only staff in this bathroom. Should we make it executive just to, uh, just to torture them? Yes, there's a bathroom right next to your workstation, but only executives can use it. Look at that, the queues, the queues, and I mean, these must be big flights that are going. This really is like Manchester with them queuing all the way down here. I thought that we'd have enough, you know, I thought we'd have enough space. Obviously not. I mean, when these are all in, this is going to be awful to look at. There's going to be so many people here. I don't know. Have we have we got like this sorted yet? We've got a wall built at least. There we are. Oh, look, they've descended on the place. The toilet is in. There you go, everybody. Use the loo. Well, there's too many people in here. It's not big enough. Is that why they're all so tired? Because I mean, look, they're exhausted. They're exhausted. They're exhausted and really need a wee. That is a problem, isn't it? Let's put another chair in. Put another chair in, because then we can fit everybody. Yeah, it's really cramped, but, you know, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Why are you not sat down? If you sit down and, and rest, there we go. Look, his energy's going up now, because he's sat down and resting. I can't believe some of them have abandoned their stations. I mean, this guy here, look at, look at him. Oh, no, it's a woman now. Oh, they've changed over, but she's exhausted. Go and get some rest, madam. Someone will take over your duty, I'm sure. Well, maybe they won't. Look, there's nobody here. That is a worry. Oh, you really need a wee as well. They all really need a wee. Why don't they just go to the bathroom? There's one there now. 
Oh. He's he's Haruki Suzuki. What a name, Haruki Suzuki. He's perfectly happy now that he's had a wee, he's had a sit down. He's thrilled. He's absolutely thrilled. Right, well, that is where we're going to leave it for today. I think we've made some good progress, uh, as always. Um, yeah, we've got plenty done. Plenty done. This is a nightmare. I don't know what we're going to do with that. There's not really a lot we can do now, is there? But, uh, yeah, in our quest to make a regional airport, I think we're doing a pretty good job. Yeah, pretty good job. I'm not an expert, am I? So, you know, all, all things considered, I don't think we're doing too badly. If you've enjoyed this video today, please do make sure that you click the like button. And, of course, subscribe if you haven't already, so that you never miss out on any future episodes of Airport CEO. Other than that, as I say, thank you so much for watching, and hopefully, I'll see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.